Hey guys, Spud Studios here. This is Sergeant Major Ponish 13, and today I am here for another ticket tutorial, and this time it's going to be on Sterling engines. So, Sterling engines can do some stuff that Redstone engines can. However, they can also do some stuff that Redstone engines engines cannot do. So, uh, we are going to compare the two later. Fill that in. Got OCD or something. Anyway, so. Uh, Sterling engines are powered by coal or lava, as you can see here, highlighted in the yellow. It is one MJ for 20,000 ticks. I don't know how long a tick is, but if you can figure it out, well, good for you. Anyway, so to craft a Sterling engine, um, they, like I said, they run on coal and lava. To craft a Sterling engine, you need a piston, which is just some cobblestone, redstone, iron ingot, and some wood. You're also going to need a stone gear, which is stone around a wooden gear, which is made of four sticks in this configuration. Okay, so for testing sake, we're going to hook it up to an oil fabricator, because I kind of like oil fabricators, even though they're incredibly slow. If you want to learn more about them, go ahead and look at one of the other tutorials I have. So sterling engines which you do is you hook them up to something and here the, I don't want to use lava right now so let's just I want to use coal so I'm old fashioned here so if you got like a lot of coal or found a deposit obviously you're gonna find some deposits of uh, uh, lava so if you got coal lava deposit just anything anything that burns I think you can just put it in here Except for maybe, uh, oh, no, wood works too. Okay, so you can use that right there. As you can see, it's not powered, and that is because you need a redstone uh, torch or just any kind of signal behind it. So you can see it's now pumping actively, and it is producing about 10 thingies per pump -a jig So, um,. Also, what we're going to look at is, so, as you can see, like the redstone engine, right here, it does not produce a beam, and this redstone engine is overheating because normally redstone engines do not overheat as long as they are actively doing something, but this one fails, and it cannot do a redstone, it cannot transfer power down this pipe and into this thing, as you can see, the power is entirely empty. Um, same goes with the Sterling engine, but see, it's burning right there. It neither can pump uh, energy down here. However, it can, as you can see with your eyes, pump energy directly into it. Um, so yeah, the Redstone engine... I'm just gonna break this here. <coughs> Sorry, uh, I need water or something. Anyway, the redstone engine does not pump anything in. See, see, that's not going up at all. And this thing's not pumping. So, uh, I'm going to set the time to day here. Uh, okay, we'll get to, as you can see, that's magma. Well, mag, mag, blah, something with the magma in it. And that's another type of engine. We'll, we'll get to that later. But as you saw in the redstone tutorial, redstone engine tutorial, Redstone can pump uh, liquids such as lava right here from this tank into something else. So what we're going to need here is a tank. Um, and we already got some pipes right here. So, oh, I've got OCD here. Uh, so we're just going to put that right there. Fill in all the grass blocks. Anyway, back to this. Uh, so... I'm going to show you the uh, what the redstone engine does first off, and see it's just pumping lava here. Um, uh, okay, so, but as you just saw, it can only be con redstone engines can only be connected 
to wooden pipes and they fail to connect to uh, well should probably not do that they fail to connect to any kind of pipe but wood see anyway back to this right here so uh, again uh, sterling engines only connect to wooden waterproof pipes and tanks just made by glass made by uh, wooden wooden transport pipe of any kind of wood glass and this which is made from cactus green just anywhere on the crafting table and if you don't know how to get cactus green it's cacti in a furnace so like you saw earlier uh, but lo and behold this also goes to that what a shocker where would you have heard this before could it have been sergeant major punch 13 hmm yes it was anyway I'm gonna put that in there and no no uh no no burning no energy going on yet but as soon as we put a signal ta-da it goes so um I think it actually might do it a bit faster it looks like um, let's just have a race real quick for fun's sake because who doesn't like a good race if you don't like a good race you're communist I'm just kidding or maybe you're fat who cares uh, we're all equal here anyway let's let's have a race let's uh stop that real quick no oh, why did I do that no I'm not going in there okay so let's just just test this out because I like testing stuff so I'm gonna put that in there and now what I have to do is put here oh it's, oh yeah that looks like it does it all a lot faster but let's just test it out but keep in mind this does not use nearly as much resources as this right here but then again coal isn't exactly rare neither nor lava so let's just see who can both two, yep looks like it uh, one two one two okay so all I have to do is okay put that there there. Oh yeah. That's that. That's not even fair. Yeah. So this the Sterling engine here is pumping faster, but uh, this has unlimited power and does not overheat as long as it's doing nothing. As long as it's doing something. My bad. This I don't really know if it overheats. It more than likely does. Uh, and it probably makes a pretty big ex no I'm sorry I know what it does it just breaks down and you have to fix it with a wrench but it doesn't blow up like a combustion engine or some other stuff um I I think that's it so that's that folks is how you use sterling engines and uh, one more thing it has power over the redstone engine is it I don't know if I showed this already but just for just to remind you if you have Alzheimer's even though this hooks up doesn't do anything this does hook up and it does do something as long as there's a redstone signal and more power 10 already okay well this is Sergeant Major Ponage 13 from Spud Studios make sure to like the video um, dislike it if you honestly didn't like it but hopefully this has been helpful to you and all your ticketing um, so leave us a comment please we'd like to know your in we'd, ha we'd love to have your input if there's anything you'd like us to record anything you'd like us any game you'd like us to record does not have to be minecraft anything you would like us to do again yeah it does not have to be minecraft and any more tutorials you would possibly need there are many yet to come in this Tekkit uh, 
area. So, anyway, subscribe, please. Uh, look at our other videos. Thanks for watching.